<laughs> no. So I, I had a question for you. Um, I heard that you guys, when you're on tour with Motorhead, you guys got thrown off the Motorhead tour? Oh, uh, yeah. Real story. <laughs> I told you. I told you. All right. So, when, uh, rest in peace to my other, my, my roadie, my other singer, Boston Mike. He was from, uh, he was from Brockton, Massachusetts. So every time, down, baby. Uh, no, listen, Hagler, all, you know what I mean? It's, it's, a, it's a Brockton, Massachusetts. Uh, uh, fuck you know, oh boy, the Italian guy, what's his name? So, it was two boxes, Marvin Hagler and fucking Rocky Marciano. They're both mm -hmm. from Brockton. So, the kids in Brockton, I, uh, to me, I uh, like Boston, the suburb, whatever, you know what I mean? But Brockton, we used to go there, always shootouts. Every show we had was a fight. It was always, but we had a whole uh, family in Brockton. Right? So uh, one of the guys is got out of jail. I'm not going to say his name, but he's, he's in jail again. So, But he, he came on tour of us. So Levy used to love fucking Jack Daniels in the thing, in the back room, and fucking you know, stripping um. Crystal Map, as we did, you know what I mean? So yeah, all these fucking hot strippers, hot metalhead strippers all mapped out and back. And we were young, we didn't give a fuck. Basically, one of the guys took a bottle of Jack Daniels, plus also, I guess he had a wallet back there with $2,000. I guess someone, someone took the $2,000. But they guess, they, no, whoever took it, it doesn't matter, it goes back to me and Scarhead. You know what I mean? Right. Yeah. So Could have been one of we got the money, we, we got, I bought him a, uh, a Jack Daniels. Uh, my father worked as security in a Thomas Industries, a liquor, liquor, biggest liquor dis distribution company on the East Coast. So I got this crazy Jack Daniels bottle with like five hundred dollars. Gave it to him. Plus, he gave money back. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And he was like, "Still, I got to throw you guys off." And then the, the drummer, Filthy Phil, was, uh, which I loved, was saying something. I told him, "Yo, calm down before I punch you in the face." And they say and then that was it. You know what I mean? But cool. But then, then right before Lemmy, like, uh, right before Lemmy, a few years before Lemmy died, I was playing a big, big uh, festival in Europe, and it was a chain link fence. And he, he was walking this way. And I was walking this way, went to the fence. And I was like, Yo, remember me? He goes, What's up, Isaac? I was like, What's up? I'm like, Everything good? He goes, Yo, I'm sorry about that. And we shook hands through the fence. Oh, that's cool. cool. That's so that's cool. a cool story to tell. But also, it's even crazier that. The biggest biker white trash band in the world kicked us off, right? Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Yeah. That's a badge of honor. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> <laughs>